hello guys thank you so much for clicking so today's video was requested by one of my subscribers from india after she watched my previous video on postpartum belly buying she requested me to do a review on this and so guys remember to give this video a thumbs up comment and don't forget to subscribe and also click the notification button so that you get notified anytime i post a video I'm done. The reviews on this Benku belly bind it's just an old tradition Malaysian way where you wrap a very long piece of fabric around your tummy after giving birth and you really need like a very long piece of fabric speak, went more. online on Amazon and I didn't find it was like the fabric was sold out so I just decided to come up with my own that is I just took uh, my scarf and cut it into two just to get this long fabric <laughs> If you know where, where we can find this fabric, just comment below. And also, guys, like if you use this in your country, you can as well comment below because I actually didn't know like this existed. I didn't have a very long fabric, so I had to come up with my own. I just took this scarf and then cut it into two just to have my own long fabric. And by the guys, I realized like for this Benku belly bind, like you just need. A fabric that has very very pretty prints because mine was kind of ugly and the ones that I saw online were so pretty remember I'm not a doctor so before you use any of this method just make sure you consult your doctor actually searched online and realized like most of the people really use this method and it has helped them but just consult your doctor before using them If you can't find this fabric anywhere, you can as well make your own. Just take different scarves or piece of cloth and stitch them together and you'll have your own fabric. So this is how I wrap them. You want to make sure you have a short tail and a long tail. And then you wrap the short tail around the long tail. And then you just overlap them on each other. I was done with my wrapping. This is how it looks, guys. And that's why I was telling you guys for this, you really need a fabric that has very pretty prints. Like you can see mine, it's so ugly. It doesn't look like this or this or this. So you really need a fabric that has really pretty prints. And so guys, my opinion on this, mm, I love it on the back. It was really comfortable, but when it comes to breathing, it really wasn't that breathable. I was just like yawning and yawning. And the reason why I was yawning is because my breathing was restricted. So for breathing, it wasn't that comfortable. And it was just tight. Like I tightened it from the bottom to the, you know, under the bust line. And it was so uncomfortable. I was not breathing so properly. So I was just yawning and yawning and yawning. And remember that guys, like this fabric that I was using, it was stretching. But after I wrapped it around my tummy like this, it wasn't stretching anymore so it was just uncomfortable and then i decided to loosen it a little bit i could at least breathe so guys i decided to unwrap it again and just wrap it and so the second time what i did i just loosened the bottom part the abdominal area Tighten, tighten the middle part and then again loosen up on the around the bust line and this was comfortable now so like if you're going to wrap it just make sure you loosen some parts because i was not comfortable like tightening from the lower abdominal area to the bust line so you just have to make sure like some parts are loose 
so that you know you're comfortable and like this is what most of the people use like just a traditional way some people use it it really has helped them according to my research it really has helped them after you know after postpartum and it's actually good for most of the women it helps in in shrinking out the uterus and just you know reducing cramping so i tried wrapping with this small scarf just to see if i'll feel any difference from the first method and i really loved it i also love the pattern and it actually looks like a belt it looks like a belt so i really loved it and i will for me personally i'll prefer wrapping it like this because it's so comfortable and breathable because there's you know some parts like i've not my abdominal area is not that tight i'm just like wrapped on the middle part of the belt and then it works so well when you're blotting or when you're just having your monthly cramps like it really works so well guys so if you're cramping or if you're blotting just try wrapping your tummy like this and guys you will thank me later because it's just it just feels so comfortable because right now i'm really feeling so relieved and uh, i just love it and so beside the traditional method you can as well wrap your tummy like this uh, it's great immediately postpartum just like this and not like the entire tummy yeah because if you really want to use this waist training after delivery this is the best waist trainer you can use it really helps so much in shaking out the uterus and just reducing the cramping <laughs> For the Benkum belly bind, I can't really say so much about it because first of all, maybe I was using the wrong material or maybe that's why the breathing was really restricted. So I think I'll just find the right material guys and just give you my uh, my honest review again on that. But for now, I think it was just too tight and not really breathable. But so guys, you can comment below if you've used it, if someone has used it, if it helps. And also for the CS, these bindings for the CS, guys, uh, you want to wait until the incision is healed because you don't want to have infections because, you know, you're not healed yet. So, and then you don't want the, the incision to open. You can consult your doctor before trying any of these bindings because, you know, I can't tell you it's safe and I'm not a doctor. So just consult your doctor and make sure it is safe to use. guys but according to the, my online research this method has really helped so many people and so many people are using it but for now i can't say uh, for me it really is comfortable i wouldn't say it's comfortable yeah so guys if you haven't watched my previous video on how to get flat tummy after delivery that was just my grandma's opinion i'll put the link down in the description box below so you can go watch and also comment if you think it really would work or if you've used the method so that was it guys for today if you haven't watched my previous videos on bar hacks diys tutorials uh, how to get flat tummy i'll put the links down in the description box below so you can go watch and remember to like this video and leave a comment